Hi there, I wanted to introduce you to uh, HHO system, which is a new, well, not exactly new, but it's it's something that's coming, becoming popular at the moment. This is a HHO system on my see it in a van here. Uh, takes a generator, which is down here, and you have hoses here, which take what's called electrolyte from the reservoir here, which holds the main body of electrolyte, which is water and potassium hydroxide. And this water circulates between the reservoir and the generator down here. And what's all this about anyhow? Uh, what this is about is a system of electrolysis, which is, if you remember, maybe back to your intercert, those of you that can remember when we done intercerts in Ireland, we studied something called electrolysis. Electrolysis is using direct current to separate water into hydrogen and oxygen. So when that's done in the generator down here, using stainless steel plates, it comes up through the holes here, this, this hose here in particular, it comes up through the reservoir here, which acts as a flashback arrestor. By that it means the gas continues on up to the reservoir and it goes in through the air inlet and the engine here. And uh, this HHO gas goes into the engine where it does several things. Number one, it, it, influ it improves the combustion of the gases immensely. And this particular vehicle now is doing, uh, on average, anywhere between 25 and 34% improvement in miles per gallon. Uh, I installed it about seven weeks ago. I installed the HHO system seven weeks ago. The, the engine also has more torque and you can notice that going up steep hills where it um, you don't have to change down to third gear. And we have lots of steep hills around here. Uh, also, the emissions should be reduced. Now I haven't measured that yet but hopefully we'll measure it soon. Uh, it also, uh, it will, a lot of trucks now have an AdBlue system and it will, it will reduce the amount of AdBlue necessary. Um, so I'm just going to start the engine up and you'll see this, you'll see the generator running. You can see the gas there. up through the reservoir here and into the engine, into the air intake. We put the uh, water in here, the ionized water. And, uh, basically it needs to be topped up approximately every once, probably every three or four weeks. And, uh, that's it. This is just electrics here so that the, when the unit is turned on, when the engine is turned on, the unit comes on, but when the ignition is on, the unit doesn't come on. You, you don't want this running without the, you don't want the HHO system running without the engine running. But there's only a small amount of gas produced anyway, so it's not, it's a relative, very safe actually system, you know. The worst, the worst possible scenario here is, here is, is you would get a loud bang, that's all, you know, if anything ever went wrong. Okay, so that's it. Uh, the system was designed by a man in Atlon there, and he spent six years solving all the problems with HHO. And there are issues with HHO. That's one of the reasons it has such, you know, it has a bad name, or it's, it has got a bad name. And uh, he spent a lot of time working with the Dublin Institute of Technology doing tests. Uh, and to my mind. This man understands HHO as, as good as probably anyone in Ireland. So, that's the system. Uh, that's the system. I think he charges 600 euro for it. And uh, he's looking to do installs now. He's also talking to some of the big companies in Ireland and the UK as regards putting the HHO device on their vehicles. That's all for me for the moment. And uh, if you want to contact me, I'll put my email address up on the up on the uh, YouTube site. See you then.